I was there for the, for the VIP tour, and I can tell you, it when you go in there, you actually, you totally, really do, you feel his presence. And there's music playing there, and they show you video clips and things that you will not see on the internet, things that you will not see anywhere else. And of course, you're not allowed to take any pictures, but you better have a good photogenic memory because it's something that you don't ever want to forget. And then they take you into a dance room and all of his editing rooms, and you can actually feel how the sound is completely sealed in there and um, it, they, t they give you a lot of a lot of really good factual based information and the, the, the tours are very very nice and I, like I said before I met Kirk Johnson which was his best man at his wedding and his drummer for many many years he was the nicest softest softest spirit that I had come across and his sister was in there she was a personal assistant for Prince and he was she she was very nice she gave me a hug I started to cry she told me be happy this is what he wanted and the people inside are really really fabulous but they're really really strong on the rules so you can't bend them but it's totally worth the money if you can if you can go you need to go that you actually get to go inside you get to sample some of his food that his favorite foods they have a great gift shop on the inside and and they're not they don't run it they don't they're not running out of sizes they're not running out of merchandise and everything is just really fabulous so if you can go you really should go it's it's worth every single minute was this minute. the highlight of the year for you uh, this is this is this is the highlight of my life I said I said my husband I love you and everything, but if we don't go, I'm divorcing you tomorrow. <laughs> so, so we came, and he's actually in the car, freezing, and he says, go and do whatever you're going to do, but he was on the tour with me, and when I very first walked in, I fainted at the door because I just was so taken by everything, you know, just actually being there. You fainted? I fainted, and they told me that if I didn't get it together, they were going to have to call 911, and that I and that I wasn't going to be able to go on the tours. So I, I buckled up real quick and brought it all together really quick um so but i'm glad that i did i wouldn't have missed it for the world but um what did he mean to you what does he mean to you he's gone but is he really gone in your life i don't think he'll ever be gone see the the one thing the one thing that i think is absolutely he, he meant if i was happy he was part of it if i was sad he was part of it if it was something that confused me or i didn't know what to do he was always He's always, he's always been a presence in my life and his music has always guided me and helped me see the better side of things and also see the dark side. He understand, he helped me understand the world more about, about the record business, about the music business and about music itself and he just helped me really grow as, as a person.